by the time you guys have seen this um, vlog, obviously, I would have either gotten it or not. Currently looks like a crazy person. Wi-Fi is on. Wow. Yeah, I'm wearing tight. <laughs> I draw the line at tight. <laughs> Hi guys, good morning. It's your girl Sadi. As you guys have seen in the, I'm not wearing earrings. Oh, wow. As you guys have seen in the title, I have my first official interview, physical interview. In short, it's my first official in interview period coming up tomorrow. Today is Friday, the twenty. Sorry, the fifth, and tomorrow is the sixth, and tomorrow is the interview. So, by the time you guys have seen this vlog, obviously, I would have either gotten it or not. <laughs> so, <laughs> I've never actually had a physical interview. So, I'm having so much anxiety. You guys don't know this, but I actually was invited for an interview back in, I think, March. Yeah, I think March. And I didn't go. One, because the place is like literally like on my same street. Like, okay, no, on my street extension. It's, a, it's like an accounting like firm um like someone's um, accounting firm so it's on the extension of my street not my clothes my street so i was like first of all it's too close to the house i, mean, I was not thinking of i'm saving transport i was thinking of the fact that even though my house is too close to the like it's very close one they were like they can call you on saturdays to come to work and just stuff like that and then two like any small thing that if they call me for house they make home you understand like yeah i get it it's trackable from the house if i feel like take, doing exercise because it takes me like maybe 10 to 15 minutes to walk there if i enter the case like three to five minutes but like yeah i didn't go because i like one i had anxiety about the whole thing because i was like what is the ask me accounting questions get that one because it's like an accounting thing i haven't opened my accounting books in like years <laughs> in two years since 2020 december so yeah that's why i didn't go for that one anxiety plus i didn't want like i was scared i was basically i was scared now this time i, I can't even escape it because i don't know the i'm going to have to go through this one like sometime so i might as well i like i'm ah oh, god it's, it's so scary it currently looks like a crazy person but i'm losing my hair I just got, I, like, I was sitting and I was like, bro, I'm fucking tired. I've been doing this for like, well, I don't know how long. I don't know when I started. Honestly. For. Eh. I'm taking a break now. Just carving biscuits. I'm watching. Sorry, I'm talking while I'm eating. I'm watching Blown Away. Season 3 came out, so. Yeah, I'm watching Season 3. I'm episode 3 already. I don't have any favorites yet. I'm just weird. I just have people that I don't like. What's up, guys? So, I did my hair. Last minute decision because I want to look pretty tomorrow and I'm really looking different. Probably because I'm not wearing earrings. Anyways, I'm about to pick my outfit. So, I want to. I'm carrying my entire corporate box out. Um, my corporate box. If you're not. If you're new on my channel, hi. My brother is staring at me like a creep. Wow. Anyways, I have three boxes. The big box oh, is <laughs> what? The big box is for my. Mm. Okay. Why is it standing there? The Wi-Fi is on. Wow. Wow. Okay, so this is the base of like my outfit. I'm also going to wear shoes tomorrow. Should I wear the shoes now? Yeah, I should wear the shoes now. So that I can have a full picture of the entire outfit because like shoes actually make it different. Um I told you guys I had quick quick shoes, but I'm not going to wear quick quick shoes for an interview. So these are the shoes. I really don't like them. I prefer like the ones that look like um brooks. Um my brother is here, so you guys might be hearing commentary. <laughs> but yeah, this is the base of my outfit, so like everything black. Um so now we're going to try and pick a top. This this looks a little bit too casual to well, me. Can go to work like this. Yeah, I can go to work like this, but like you know, you want to impress yeah, them. Yeah, um, bossing up corporate shirts. Black. Yeah. I don't. I do I have another one. 
The other one is like cutting match and the is long sleeve but tight here. I mean, I'm not wearing tight. <laughs> I draw the line at tight. I have a blazer, but it's currently no it's dirty. It's not dirty, but it has been outside in black suit. So I'm going to have to wash it if I'm going to wear it tomorrow. I mean, I just have to use the washing machine now. I don't want to wear in blazer because I will sweat. Do you get? Like I don't want that whole stress of then when I now remove it and I now have to make sure that I don't forget it if I drop it somewhere. I beg that's too much stress. But yeah, this is the option first. Uh, first option. This is my second option. I already untucked it because I was like no. But yeah, no. <laughs> uh, absolutely not. Um, I'm now at this point now. Yeah, I'm actually rethinking the whole trouser idea because I don't know whether it's like. I just feel like it's the type. This is too casual. I can wear this to work. But to an interview, no. <laughs> so like I said, I have a blazer. Um, but do you know what I'm not thinking now? That like, what if I now get it tomorrow and then people are wearing blazers? But well, this is like a long line blazer. It's like it's like long. Um, it's more like supposed to be a fashionable. Like obviously you can wear it to the office, but this is like the whole all black thing. It doesn't work for me. Okay, I think I found the one. It doesn't look like much right now. It shrunk, yeah. But like once I iron it out, it's going to stretch. Um, it's really shrunk right now. But I think this doesn't. I think this looks good. Yeah, it's like a dark. I, Cause I don't want to do bright colors. I don't want to be like I'm trying to stand out. I'm not trying to stand out. Like so, it's not be like who does she like? Why is she trying to like? Do you know? I don't know. But I feel like this looks good. Like the high neckline. Um. Hey guys. So I'm currently making ego sea soup. Currently I have my palm oil, crayfish powder and my tomato mix in here so Stuff that they told me to bring. They said soft copy. They said scanned copy and physical copy. So I feel like this scanned copy should be in a flash because I don't know how else I would show it to them. So yeah. Good morning. <laughs> this is the situation my bed right now. Um, so these are the documents they told me to bring. I just have two copies each, and then I have like this stuff that I want to use to just read. Um, I just typed out some stuff. Um, basically did some stuff that I should know you understand don't worry I'm going to go and do my news this morning I was lazy yesterday anyways see you guys later in the day good morning guys so as you guys have seen today is the day of my aptitude tests <laughs> um, like I said I showed you guys I think in the previous video no was it a previous video I, I know I showed you guys told you guys about how the whole thing was and how they said there's like five tests today aptitude test personality test skills test integrity test yeah i think those four and then they put lunch break so i think they're going to feed us maybe i don't know um but yeah this is currently 9 20 and i want to go and get bread so i can make eggs and eat bread and eggs for breakfast so i'm currently packing my bag i borrowed my mom's bag these are still out because i need a file for them um then the flash drive they told me to put stuff in so I have a flash drive um I'm just trying to figure out what I need I don't know um uh, I've carried I borrowed my brother's <laughs> calculator and my sets so 
my friend said I should carry stationery, so I just have that. Um, and that's all I think that I have. And I'll soon be leaving the house. This is currently 10 37 a.m. Um, so yeah, see you guys soon. Oh my god, I'm so like, I'm not actually nervous. I, I never feel nervous on the day of something. I feel nervous the days leading up to it, but the day of it, I'm just like, okay, what can I do about it? Like, I'll go there, I'll do my best. If it doesn't work out, it doesn't work out, you understand? But yeah, wish me luck, guys. Even if by the time you get us in this vlog, I'm already done, but like, <laughs> um, thank you so much for coming on this journey with me, and I hope it's a positive one and not a negative one. I'll catch you guys later. Okay, so the fifth bag. Come with you, that is awesome. Yeah, wish me luck. Okay. I look horrible. I look very different from how I looked this morning. Hello, guys. I look so tired. I've taken off my wig because you cannot kill me. I've been having a serious, like, really serious headache for a while. I even, like, when I was there, I hooked my wig. Like, literally, anybody could touch my head and the wig would fall off. But, giving you guys an update on how the whole thing went. I think I might still do a, like, sit down. I'm tired. My hand is probably going to be shaky. But, um, we got there. My, oh, I scheduled my test for 12 p.m., as you guys know. So, I got there, and then I saw a crowd. I was like, what? Like, so, I think I showed you guys this. Obviously, I couldn't raise up my phone. But, yeah, I showed you guys. There was a lot of crowd who were, like... More than 100 people there, and people just kept on coming and coming. And I got there before it, um, for 12, so obviously, people kept on coming and coming. By the time it was 12, I think we were at least 200 there, you know. And then, um, so we're still down there, 12 past, one past, and we're literally still sitting down. So, by I think past one was when they now said between themselves, they now discussed and stuff. I know, I think it was like almost two o'clock let me say almost two o'clock yeah then they were like oh they went upstairs like the crowd was not moving at all so the crowd wasn't moving at all and so by that time they were like you know what you guys use your phones you can use your phones they gave us the website which was the same website that we use for the online one so basically we could have done this thing at home i think the whole thing why they said we should come was because obviously they wanted to monitor better and all so we and at the end of the day on my phone um it was the aptitude test was 100 questions, 2 hours. I finished in like about 50 minutes, I think, the 100 questions. And then, um, so it was basically like the one we did online. It was quantitative, verbal, no, it was, uh, yeah, quite math, um, English, comprehension, then um, banking related questions, then customer service related questions and communication questions. So that was basically what it was. Then there was an integrity test. So basically they'll be asking you, um, have you ever driven without a driver's license? Have you ever done this? Basically, you're supposed to say the truth. <laughs> and you say what you want to hear. And then there was a personality test. So they ask you, uh, they give like statements. So like, I tend to think, to act based on emotions or based on clinical. Strongly agree, strongly disagree, basically. So that was basically how it was. And I finished, like I said, in, I finished the absolute test in like 40 something minutes and the other ones they were supposed to be like 20, 20 minutes each i think the integrity test was <clears throat> 57 questions 20 minutes the personality test was 110 questions 20 minutes um so i finished those ones in like maybe 20 minutes combined like 10 minutes each and so yeah and then i was just sitting down there so i finished before i mean like i think three on the dot when i was done 
but someone else used my phone so i was still there till like i left there by 4 30 and i go home um it's like past five now um this is 5 25 now so i'm like really tired so um i'll probably maybe later on i'll like give if i i don't think there's any more detail like this is actually all that happened were just there when they told us to use our phones people were collaborating and act, like helping themselves and stuff um but yeah initially it was supposed to be like you use their systems to do it but like i think they didn't plan it out well um they should have sent us to different um branches of the bank along with somebody alone they're like four access banks they should have actually spread themselves out to the different branches but that's their personal problem i've done the test i'm waiting i don't i've not yet gotten an email there's people that checked like their scores on the website but i don't want to check because the people are seeing fail <laughs> i agree i must have passed i cannot accept anything apart from pass so i'm not going to check i'm going to wait for ayo to text me and send me an email that i am i am invited for the next stage that's all that's all that's, that's the list i'm with if they should if ayo should send me a message that sorry i'll say ayo please change this statement don't don't do this to me <laughs> but yeah um that's how today went i'll give you keep you guys updated on what message ayo sends me ayo is the guy the communications guy <laughs> so in case everybody's like who is ayo who is ayo is the HR, I don't want to say HR, but it's the person that sends emails. Like his name shows Ayo, and then also in the text messages, it shows Ayo. So, Ayo. <laughs> all of us are saying, God, please let Ayo text me this evening. That's what all of us are telling ourselves when we're leaving. <laughs> I don't know why I smiled like that. Hi, guys, good morning. So, today is Sunday, and I think I want to do a vlog. Last time I did a vlog like this on this Sunday, Sunday, get ready with me. Brian came, I was like, So now we know why you come to church. <laughs> But like, yeah, not necessarily, but today is Sunday. My brother left home today, so he's going to school today. And so it's, it's like 7 a.m. because he left by like 6 something, like 6.50. So I'm just, I was on my bed and I was like, you know what? I feel like eating stir fry noodles and eggs. So that's what I'm going to make for breakfast now. And I'm just in the kitchen trying to decide what I want to do. Um, as for my outfits, we thank the Lord that there's light because yesterday, oh my gosh, the things that went through yesterday anyways so i want to make stir fry noodles for breakfast my peppers cameroon and fresh pepper i don't want to do pepper this morning yes it's indomie what is indomie without pepper you know what let's just start something let's boil water there's water in the kettle if it's empty why is this still here it's, what for You won't be just use matches in my house. It's just quite it's quite funny. This is the noodles we're going to use today. One egg. Now, people have seen the ingredients. The next thing you'll see is the indomie. Because I'm not going to stress myself to try to set up my phone to video myself cooking. People have seen enough of that in my previous vlogs. I've tried. Mm? I'll be cooking with one hand, holding the other food, the food with one hand. So next thing people will see now. Okay, so this is what I'm thinking of going to church. Uh, one of my tops that I made, as you guys know, um, with my seated skirt. Um, I don't know. I honestly don't want to go, but <laughs> I'm so tired. Like, I don't know. Yesterday was very, very stressful for me, honestly. I honestly just want to stay home and sleep. But at the same time, I can't. It's not like anybody would know if I don't go, but like I will know, and God will know. So, I'm just gonna go. Okay, so I'm ready to go, and well, flat shoes. I know it's going to obviously look better with um, maybe heels, but I don't feel like wearing heels today. Like I said, I'm not in a very great mood today. So we're gonna have to just do with these. Um, just paired it with two rings, one here, one here. My wristwatch and then this bag. I don't know why this thing is raising up. But yeah, that's the fit for today. Yeah. 